Wow. <laughs> I just... Wow. Can I do a little, kind of little spin? <laughs> Dibs. <laughs> Branson, today I have loved you for 2,106 days. As I sit here and reminisce over the last six years of our lives together, my heart melts with memories that I'll hold on to forever. Ever since I was a little girl, I've dreamt about my wedding day and wondered who would be at the end of the aisle waiting for me, who I would build a life with, and who would be my greatest adventure. Branson Keith Rogers, you were everything I've ever dreamt of and more. God truly brought you into my life at the perfect time, and you have healed scars, mended a broken heart, and gave me hope that I can truly live happily ever after. To my lovely bride, nearly six years in the making and we're finally here. I still remember getting butterflies walking you back to my white truck before officially asking you to be my girlfriend. That moment will forever be the defining point of my life when I made the absolute best decision that I could ever make. Before you, I always felt like there was a hole in my heart, like something greatly important was missing. I had moments where I cried to myself and seriously wondered if I would ever be able to find love. And then I found you. I vow to always assume the best of you and to seek your understand, your heart, and your mind. I vow to unconditionally love you and ensure you know you are the most valued person in my life, always. I vow to continually grow our friendship, always giving the best of myself and expecting nothing more than I know you can give. I vow to be the best father to our future children and ensure that I can give them the time and attention that they deserve no matter how busy life may become. I vow to always be loyal to you, to keep our marriage exciting and adventurous. I vow to always treasure the present while actively building for our future. And I vow to never stop striving to be the best husband I can be because life is ever changing and I will always find new ways to show you my love. This I promise you for all the days of my life. I vow to unconditionally respect you and make your abilities, heart, mind, thoughts, and actions feel valued. I vow to continually grow our friendship, always giving the best of myself and expecting nothing more than I know you can give. I vow to be the best mother to our future children and ensure they grow up feeling protected, loved, accepted, and provided for. I vow to never stop striving to be the best wife I can be because life is ever changing and I will always find new ways to show you my love. This I promise you for all the days of my life. I now pronounce you husband and wife and best friends for life. Branson, you may kiss your sweet bride. <laughs> friends and family, it's my joy to present to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Rogers. And she's like, okay. And I've always known about Branson, okay? I've always known that they've been friends forever. But I remember her saying, okay, I have this friend. His name's Branson. And I think you might like me, but I need you to look at him and just like watch him and like see how he reacts. And the moment that he looked at Nicole, that was when I knew that he was in love with her. And that was the moment too that I knew that she was in love with him and he, she didn't know it yet. I just knew from that moment on, I was watching something amazing grow. And for the past few years, I have had the privilege of watching it firsthand. And it has just been an amazing journey. Nicole, I am so happy that you found your person. And Branson, I wanted to thank you from the bottom of my heart 
for treating her the way that she has deserved her whole life and for showing her what a true gentleman really is because there is no one else that deserves it more than her. I can stay up all night with you Talk for hours and say nothing but I love you